Hey folks, Troy Dooley here with the Weekly News in Review. We cover it from continent to continent. I mean, sea to shining sea, the direct selling network marketing, MLM marketing channel. It doesn't matter what you call it. Okay, we're covering it. If it has to do with brokers, independent brokers, independent business partners, uh, brand partners, whatever, we're there. And we, we have a blast. This week we're, we're sponsored by... Gary Sinise's organization with the Lieutenant Dan Band. They are bringing out a brand new movie on July 4th. Now this is what's rocking about this. I have been following this over a year now because Gary Sinise, you know, he started out as Lieutenant Dan in the Forrest Gump movie and he's held on to that. And I love his acting. You know, at, at Christmas time there's always a movie on the Hallmark Channel where where he goes back to his hometown, ends up falling in love, obviously, uh, with his childhood sweetheart. It's great, but it's got a, a pretty powerful message to it. And that's so different from what he plays on, on CSI New York. So I like that. But his passion for our troops are second to none. And with 4th of July right around the corner, with the launch of this movie right around the corner, I decide we're going to have them as the sponsor. Uh, it's, a it's a blast. And we'll talk about more sponsorship opportunities for you at the end of the show. We got a lot of stuff to cover that I want to get. Let me let me put on, you know, you can tell you're old when your kids say, didn't you hear what I said, Dad? Or you got to put on these little bifocal things. Uh, I can still shoot straight, though. Vima, I'm excited about this. We popped this up over here. I just love their PR team over there. Lynn sent this over to me. Vima was awarded the Stevie Award for Best Convention. And, and I got to tell you something. You know, you guys know, I just love BK and the girls and, and everybody he has on that team. But I'm going to show a couple of videos from their convention because I do think they held true to what the what the actual message was. And the message this year was was really focused on motivate, train, and elevate their brand partners. And BK's done a phenomenal job at, at building his brand partners, at building the brand internationally. Matter of fact, I'm going to be talking about India here in a few minutes. And, and BK's been opening up this year, not just, I mean, India I think was last year, but he's opened up in all these other countries, Kenya. I've got relatives that are in Kenya, and BK's got the product in Kenya now, and it's it's a beautiful thing because that country was ripped apart, uh, man, almost worse than we were during the Civil War. I mean, it they, they, it's bad, and here they are with a middle America, I mean, middle America, with a middle income coming out and taking control, and I love that. I love seeing what we've got going over there. Talking about India, Tiara, T A H I R A is selling diamonds jewelry through MLM. Now, this is what's so big. I'm going to pop this up. You're going to be able to go over and read the news report. But here's what's so cool about this. This company manufactures diamonds. Okay, we're talking about... We're, I guess what we're looking at is, over the last few years, there's been this crap that's been going on in network marketing, direct selling, where you create a compensation plan and then you find a product that'll fit. I, I don't care if it's just, you know, we're going to sell this organic honey from, where is this from? Fresh Market, now that we've put a comp plan to it. So it didn't matter what the widget was, pitch the widget out the window, and it's the compensation plan. But it didn't start out that way. The concept behind direct selling was that we're going to go directly from the manufacturer, boom, put it in the field. Okay, now we're starting to see this change. I just did a, a, a review on uh, Rustelli Direct, a food manufacturer distribution, you know, and they've started their own direct marketing arm. This is the way it's supposed to be. Here's a diamond manufacturing company in India who have launched a direct selling arm. Phenomenal. I mean, think about this. India is the largest democracy in the world, and they're kicking butt. Direct selling in India is going like crazy right now. I love it. Um, Wall Street Journal reported. Now, listen. This is great. Wall Street Re Journal reports Mary Kay in April signed up 165,000 brand new consultants. 165,000 in the month of April alone. At the same time, this is what's funny about this, at the same time they made that announcement, the Congress of U.S. the U.S. Congress of Mayors reported 7.3 million job losses in 365 major metropolitan areas. I tell you what, direct selling is on a rise worldwide. You know, there's like 28, 29 billion dollars a year sold in products in the United States. Do you realize that if you add up all the other continents, all the other countries, everywhere else, we're we're like this big. 
The international expansion is huge. The U.S. expansion is huge. What part do you want? But what, it doesn't matter if you're a company owner or if you're a distributor. If you're a broker, as, as they're called in Rustelli Direct, which is right, what is it that you want? This is what you've got to ask yourself. You cannot listen to the dull, negative, disillusioned crybabies that are telling you direct sales don't work. It's a pyramid. Oh, that's a scheme. Don't listen to that garbage. I don't care what company you're in. If that company fits your personality, if it fits the passion for what you have, if you're willing to dig hard, because it's it's going to be both working hard and working smart. You gotta you gotta you gotta learn. It's a learning curve, and if you're willing to go out there and learn about the industry, I have people all the time saying, Troy, you know so much about these companies. I don't know a lot about the companies, but I study the industries in which they're marketing in. So I get to know: Will this work? Is this company staying true to where the industry is at? We did the report in our newsletter this week about the energy niche. And I warned distributors, deregulation doesn't mean no regulation. And we put documents up there for your benefit. You have to be a student. I don't care what your upline says in this case. Okay, and, and uplines, listen to me on this one. Okay, it isn't about not learning. It isn't about not training. Yes, it's about building the organization. You need to build your own marketing and distribution system. But you have to be a student of the industry you're in or you'll screw it up for your company. And CEOs, you need to hold true with the distributors. I've got a, I've said this before, but I've got a publicly traded telecom company. And they let some of their distributors go hog wire on the internet and it's going to hurt everybody. You cannot do that. You've got to rein them in, do it right. It's the only way to go. Uh, but the Wall Street Journal, I mean, if we can get written up in the Wall Street Journal, I think we're doing something right. So things are going good. Uh, let's look at what else. Oh, over the last couple of years, I want to. I want to. We're going to do a review on this company. They're a, a DSA member company, but over the last couple of years, I've watched the merger of two small companies, and they're in. Uh, I don't know. I guess they'd go somewhere like Home Interiors. I mean, it, it would be that type of a of the niche that they're in. What is it? Home Furnishings, I guess. Beautiful. But as I've watched this company bring two cultures together, similar cultures, cultures, but they brought them together and made one community out of it. And, and it's it, it, under the leadership, this is the great thing, under the leadership of Bill and Robin Shaw, Willow House is coming on strong. In a down economy, this little company is, I mean, literally is, is I believe we'll see them on the top 100 list in the next couple, three years because they're doing it right. They're, they're, they're getting right back into where they need to be, and that's the exciting part of what we see. Hey, something new. My buddy, Lynn Clements, he, he, ne he just never stops. He's always doing something, always kicking butt, always, always figuring out a way to, to change the world, and he's just launched something brand new that i got to tell you about. It's called the MLM Bureau. If you're a trainer, if you're a consultant, uh, if you're a speaker, if you're a corporate attorney, if you're anything like that, you can register over here on his site. I'm going to put this up. And it's going to be a one-stop shop. That way when critics come into our industry looking for people, there'll be a place for them. If somebody's looking for a keynote speaker, there'll be somebody. If you need a, a witness, there'll be somebody. I, I just love this. I think it's great what he's doing. I had to put that up there. If you have not read our newsletter, you'll see it going across here. You can go to newsletter dot beachsideceo.com newsletter.beachsideceo you can see our most current newsletter there our android apps you guys heard me talk about this you have made this the most successful download i want to thank you our mlm news is now 35,000 downloads our brand new beachside ceo where a lot of my coaching training stuff like that comes out uh, has already got a thousand downloads to it i am i am i'm humbled first of all uh, but it's it's you guys spreading the word we're, we're getting that out, and, and even the Android market will, I think we go on to the Apple platform sometime in July. But it's you guys. We're getting the message out there, and I, and I love that. That's That right there is what it's about. Hey, if you like these newscasts each week, you love seeing this, you love what we're doing, I'm opening up for some sponsorship opportunities for you guys, both at a corporate level and individual levels. And I'm talking about sponsoring our newscasts, not just on Friday, but stuff that we do throughout the week when it's a deal. Not company reviews. I want you to know this. Okay, Our company, when I go in and we review a company, we haven't done that because somebody paid us. We dig deep and look, but we will take sponsorship opportunities. Distributors, leaders, corporations, if they want to sponsor us to keep this non-biased, straight across newscast flowing, to keep the information out there, to be able to, to keep digging, to keep our team rolling, 
then we've got this available. You can go to BeachsideCEO.com, click on Sponsors, and you'll be able to see exactly what it is we offer. See what fits for you because we're excited about this. This is different than advertising. We're doing some advertising on some of the blogs, but this is specifically to make you a sponsor of our new show. Similar to what you see on, on newscast all the time over on Fox News, what you see on radio shows, talk radio, that's what we're doing. Uh, this sponsorship opportunity will also allow you to get some, uh, some air time on our radio shows. If you haven't listened, you can check them out. We have fun there. But guys, that's the news for this week. Stay tuned. Next week's going to be an awesome time, and if you've got something you want to get to us, Hey, send me, just send me a quick email, troy at beachsideceo.com is a good way to just get me, boom, right there. We'll look at it. The team will work on it. We'll see what we've got. We want to get this information out to you guys. Live life like it's an epic adventure. I'll see you at the top.